Hi friends, today we will make scheme for petty mischief, I mean remote signal silencer for consumer devices such as a TV, DVD player, in general for any devices with an infrared remote control. Any remote control works on a specific fixed frequency which is called the carrier. Typically, this frequency can be from 36 to 40 kHz, but it's possible rare exceptions, all depending on the manufacturer. The information is transmitted by an infrared LED, which sends a coded signal in binary form. Each command has a particular sequence of ones and zeros. The code is changed depending on the command, but the frequency carrier is always stable. The information comes to the device receiver and then it is decoded. The silencer idea is simple. Our device will send an infinite sequence of binary code without any combinations, that is, an empty signal. These false signals will be received by the receiver but can't decode it. At the same time, real signal from the remote control will be turned off or, rather, will not be processed. Here is the scheme. As a generator is used timer ME555. It is possible to use any other generator circuits. Generator is tuned to the desired operating frequency by trimmer. Timer output is loaded on PMP structure bipolar transistor. I use the medium power BD140 transistor. The choice is due to the fact that I have a lot of these transistors. But you can use literally any, even the low power transistors such as 2N5401 or BC557. The transistor will not heat, so you don't need an additional heatsink for cooling. A pair of infrared LEDs is connected in series at the collector circuit. I took them from the remote control for cheap Chinese lamps. Ideally, the wavelength of these LEDs should correspond to the wavelengths of the LEDs in the remote control unit that you want to silence. But in practice, it is quite difficult to do due to absence of documentation about the characteristics of the LED that you bought. And in addition, every time we must adjust silencer to a particular device. I advise you to use 5 mm LEDs, though in my case, they are 3 mm. The printed circuit board is very compact and properly assembled device will work immediately. Before soldering the infrared LED, it is advisable to check generation on the third output of timer. It could be done with oscilloscope or multimeter with function of frequency measurement. Now we must rotate the trimmer and achieve frequency of 35 kHz. On the camera you can watch the glowing LED. If everything is so, turn on the TV. When silencers infrared LEDs aim at the TV receiver, try to manage it using the native remote control. If still possible management with native remote control, raising the frequency at 1 kHz, check again and so on until achieving sustained suppression of the remote control signal. Here is real-time test. Oscilloscope connected to NE555 output and we can see a signal. Remote control doesn't work. Now I turn off the silencer. And remote control works. Once more,
Finally, tune silencer is stable within a radius of 50 cm, but it is possible to increase the power, slightly reducing the resistance of R1. It just limits the current through the LEDs. If that action radius is still not satisfying, you can add more LEDs. In that case, the scheme will be as follows. Silencer's infrared LEDs must be aimed to the TV receiver to completely drown out the signal from the remote control. A ready device can be installed in any appropriate box. All necessary information, including PCB and scheme, can be found in the description under the video. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.